back to Lviv's booktube channel. My name is Kaylen. I'm sitting on the floor in front of my newer bookshelf that I haven't really discussed or shown yet. So surprise, I've had this bookshelf for a while now. I also got some Starbucks. I decided, not Starbucks, Dunkin'. I got some Dunkin' today because I was trying out the sugar plum macchiato for the first time. So we're gonna try that out. Honestly, not that bad. Not as pretty as the ads and all the photos and videos I've seen, but that's actually not bad and I like it. I did the sugar plum macchiato with almond milk. But anyhow, welcome. Today we're going to be discussing my December TBR file because I epically failed at November reading wise. I read more of Bunny, but I am literally one chapter away from finishing Bunny, but I cannot sit down for the life of me and finish that book. I don't know why it put me in the biggest reading slump and now I'm sitting here on my floor slumpish and sadness and <laughs> so I'm still reading these two books Ballard of Songbirds and Snakes and Midnight Sun but I am not actually reading them like they're just there now I have not necessarily abandoned them but I just don't have the time for those thick books. So instead, I have some shorter books I want to read in the month of December. I guess this TBR is really into two parts and the first chunk is poetry and the first book that I want to read for the month of December is Water Runs Red, a book of poems by Jenna Clare and I've been meaning to read this ever since I bought it this summer and I haven't. There's a lot of illustration and poetry so I'm excited to dive into it. The next poetry book that I want to read is Homebody by Rippy Cure. I have read her other book. Her books have either been a hit or a miss for me. The Sun and Her Flowers was definitely my favorite. Didn't really care for Milk and Honey but I can't wait to see if Homebody will be a hit too. Next up I have September Love by Lang Lave and there's a forward by Lily Reinhardt and I have already started this book for the month of December and I am loving it so far. I think I'm about 23 pages into it and I already have a couple of poems I'm like I really like. So I am excited to continue on and read the rest of this book in the month of December. The next book that is in the holiday themed books on my list that I want to read in December is in a Holidays by Christina Lauren, their latest book, and I'm excited to read it. I'm not a huge holiday book person, but I'm excited to read about this one because I loved The Young Honeymooners earlier this year, and I thought I'd give this one a try as well. It talks about our main girl, May Len, instead of Kay Len, May Len. She hates living with her parents or going nowhere job, but then they get together during Christmas time in a Utah cabin, out in the middle of the woods. She spends every Christmas here and for this year they decided to say that they are selling the cabin. When she's driving away from the cabin she's just sending out one more plea to the universe of like please like what's going on you know and then all of a sudden there's a car accident and then she keeps relieving the same day over and over again. So I am really excited. I am I'm starting chapter four and I am enjoying it so far. And plus, I love these books because they go by super quick. Next up is another holiday book, and that is Narwhal. Happy Narwhal Days by Ben Clanton. And I love his books so much. They're just such fun, good children's read. And I can't wait to spend the holiday season with my two favorite, Narwhal and Jelly, and their adventures. So I'm excited to read this, and then I'm also excited to do a video of this in the future. And last but not least, I'm hoping to have enough time to read all these books this month because we have Christmas, we have my birthday at the end of the month, and New Year's and all that stuff. So that means an extra day off for Kaylin to get some reading done. And hopefully <laughs> I can get more reading done. But the last book that I want to read this month, hopefully, and if not, Oh well. And that is Warren the 13th and The Whispering Woods. And I want to continue on with Warren the 13th because these books are really interesting, fun, definitely middle grade, but I love the illustrations. I have just over the past like two years become hooked on graphic novels and picture kind of books. I never thought I would ever like graphic novels, comics, anything like that, but I have slowly progressed into that. And, and poetry. Like, who am I? 
but it's so exciting to see my reading taste change over the years. But anyways, that's gonna be it. That's my short little TBR, uh, mostly poetry books. So hopefully I can finally reach my Goodreads rating goal and my 10,000 page count goal because that's all that I need left to complete. I literally need to finish Bunny and then I could complete my goal for the year, but I don't know. It's just... I just can't like, I just don't know why I haven't picked up the last chapter yet, but here we are. So anywho, these are the books that I wanna read this month. So let me know what books you plan on reading in the comment section down below. And anyways, I will see you next time for a new bookish video.